Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I really appreciate you stopping by and you got here just in time. That's right, just in time for another scooter tour. Another first person view tour of a campground. I have traveled far and wide and I find myself once again at Lake Pat Mays, Pat Mays Lake, Pat Mays East Recreation Area. If you've been following the channel, you'll recall a couple of years ago, I was here and this campground was closed. It's open today. I've got a little red, the high speed mobility scooter. I've got the GoPro Hero 9, but best of all, I have you. So let's hop on little red and travel on this road. It is a very bumpy road. Let's go, cue the music. This is a long straight road. There may be some audio, some wind noise issues with the audio. I'm having some uh, wireless mic problems. So we're gonna roll with it the way it is. Pat Mays, north of Paris, Texas. This is, in my opinion, a hidden gem in the recreation.gov system. The pictures, they do not do these, this lake, this area, these campsites justice. You just, just know this, this road is, it's bad. When we get down here to the camping loops, it gets, real bad <laughs> so we're gonna go fast i'm gonna focus on avoiding these bad expansion joints and you just enjoy the scenery see the dump station it is the only dump station there are two camping loops a and b and we will visit them in alphabetical order so we will come back and go that way uh, i was pleasantly surprised this morning to find that Pat Mays East Campground has an equestrian loop and an equestrian trail. I haven't seen a whole lot of hiking trails in anywhere on Pat Mays Lake, but there's most definitely a horseback trail. distinctive points of interest here at Pat Mays East is the designated swim area. Now these are equestrian sites. If you want to get a better view of those, down in the description you'll find a link to campgroundviews.com. 
they've got 360 degree views of all the campsites. All right, this is the swim area here on our left. It looks quite refreshing. And you don't really have to worry about too many people speeding on this really rough stretch of road. It's a beautiful campsite overlooking the lake. We're coming around and we will visit the boat ramp and then we'll cut through the the camping loop. Although it's gravel, I'm not really excited about the prospect of navigating the gravel campground loop. Here is the boat ramp. Now we're going to go up here and look at these campsites. Getting up there is going to be a bit of a challenge because it's gravel and it's a hill. these campsites have paddocks but not all and it does appear that if you don't have a horse you're not required to have a horse they don't discriminate apparently Very, 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 very rough. Okay, so these are all the campsites up here. We do need to swing back and visit those three that have the balcony overlook. Apparently that's Dave's picnic area right there with no table. gravel and get back on the, the rough pavement. Give you another perspective of that really nice over lake overlook site. What a view. What a beautiful view. Okay. We should have done that first. That's all a loop A. So now we're going to boogie on over to loop B. Loop D loop. Loop B loop. We're going to go loop B loop. Now the equestrian trail is right there in that brush. There is a small sign to let you know. It's almost like you have to be in the know to know. See what I did there? Yeah. Ah. 
that's a little joke there. Very little. It's hot and sticky. It's uh, June 15, 2022. We're, we're, we're gonna have a hot summer. Got a high pressure sitting over Oklahoma and moisture coming up from the Gulf. So the dew points uh, like 75. You walk outside and you're wet. But that's all right. I like it that way. I like it that much better that way than cold. That's all about. They use, I guess. And yes, that road is as rough as it looks. All right, we're gonna we're gonna break the law here. Do not enter. Breaking the law. Breaking the law. To catch me. And once again, we have to navigate some really rough gravel roadage. Looks to me like it would be easier to get level on most of these sites than the sites over on the west campground. But the roads are worse <laughs> over here. All right, one more point of interest, and that is the boat ramp. There's actually two boat ramps. Pat Mays East. That one opens up onto a, a cove, a creek channel. All right. We're going to pull up over here by white lightning and close it out. Hi. Hope y'all enjoyed that as much as I did. Those are always so much fun. Thank you for coming along on the ride. If you found it to be fun, entertaining, enjoyable, informative, if you got something out of it, please click on that thumbs up. And if you've not already, I'd be most honored if you'd consider clicking on the subscribe button. That makes me feel good when you do that. And for those of you who have been following along, that's why I am out here. I just how cool is that? Thank you for that opportunity. And for my patrons, I am most grateful. You rock! All right, y'all come back now, you hear?